I know it's been about two weeks, but Pat Guy has dropped a new video. Y'all been blowing up my notifications telling me that this one's fire. So let's get into it, man. I'm gonna assume that most of you guys are familiar with a YouTuber named Mr. Beast, and a uh -huh. lot of you have probably seen his most popular video he's ever posted, which is Squid Game in Real Life, a video I have that it. currently has almost 600 million views. Crazy. Now, one of the contestants that participated in that video is this woman right here. And upon the posting of the video, she had gained a ton of popularity, pretty much because a lot of people thought she was very attractive. Now, is she? After gaining this newfound attention she, she decided she was gonna start can you guess it and only fans to try and of course <laughs> Of course, bro. It's the number one way to make money as a female these days, bro. OnlyFans shaking ass, throwing pussy. She decided she was gonna start, can you guess it, an OnlyFans to try and rake in that internet simp money. Now, where things started getting really weird is that she decided to use her family members, such as her younger brother and grandfather, no. to promote the OnlyFans, producing such bangers such as here, where she literally asks her grandfather what he would do with her if he had 15 minutes. Please tell me, please tell me. Please tell me this is fake. Please tell me this is fake. That's not her real grandpa and that's not her real brother, right? This is damn near disgusting, damn near trifling. I'm not going to lie. To have your family members indulge in this degeneracy is insane, woman. If you had 15 minutes for me, what would you do? Well, you know, uh, I'd have to think about uh, certain things, you know, certain factors like speed of sound and, and light. The hell he talking about? We're here where she literally has her younger brother talk about the color of her genitals. So how does it feel to have a sister that has an OF? My friends always ask me if it's pink, but I don't really know what they mean by that. Nani? Why is that the color that everybody wants the vagina to be? Bubblegum pink. Like, <laughs> I have had some roast beef pussy out here these days. It don't make no difference to me, bro. <laughs> You're probably wondering why am I talking about this internet lunatic? Well, you see another YouTuber who you may know named Veshremi who recently mm -hmm. made a video calling out her very weird behavior. Excuse me, hi, yeah, if you had 15 minutes with me, what would you do? Who the f*** would want to spend 15 minutes with you? You have an only f***. Once <laughs> posted, she actually went and commented on the video saying this. Keep using me for views. You wouldn't say any of this to my face. You're just mad I make more money than you ever would. The thing is, keep using me for views is a crazy thing to say when you have your family members talking about your OnlyFans and your little brother talking about bubblegum pink pussy. Like, yo, you have no right to be talking. That's kind of nasty. I'm not going to lie. Actually, it's not even kind of nasty. That's disgusting, woman. Like, bro, relax. Relax, bro. These OnlyFans females, man. Keep using me for views. You wouldn't say any of this to my face. You're just mad I make more money than you ever will. So Vishremi saw this comment and decided that he would actually contact her and set up a call in which she can then confront him for what he was saying just like she originally wanted love it now here's where things get interesting because then he hit me up and of asked course if i could join the call with them as a backup to roast the hell out of this only fans girl don't call her only fans girl and only fans thought i call it like it is she had thought uh hello uh can you hear me who the f is this? Oh, uh, hi. I'm oh, sorry. This is Jeff. She's not ugly, though. Uh, I Jeff. Who the f is Jeff? Who the f is Jeff? Damn. Hey, can she... we calm down here for a minute, please? Relax. Uh, my name is Jeff Bridges, all right? I'm in town. Why her attitude like this? Like, it's only been two seconds in a call. She over here tripping. Like, bitch, relax. You show your tits and ass for money. I need you to shut the fuck up for five seconds, okay? Can we calm down here for a minute, please? Uh, my Why name is Jeff Bridges, voice like all right? Barack I'm Obama. I still don't. Camilla, 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 you need to calm down, all right? My name is Jeffrey. You sound like Brock. Because it's on your Discord profile. Okay, I can read. It's She's literally retarded. right there. I'm simply just reading She's your profile. Retarded. Hey, here, Jeff Bridges. I still don't know who oh, the f you are. Well, well, I'm about to introduce myself. So if you'd give me one second to introduce myself and stop mouthing off to me, maybe you could figure it out, all right? Excellent. Is it humanly possible to stop bitching for five seconds? Can you do that for me? I'm just, I'm just wondering. <laughs> I'll, give you, I'll give you five minutes. Ready? Go. Okay, there we go. Five minutes. Bitch, you, you couldn't shut the fuck off for five seconds. Now you'll get on five minutes. Meow. I'll give you like, I'll give you five minutes. Ready? Go. Okay, there we go. So my name is Jeff Bridges, like I was saying, and I'm actually a talent scout for a OnlyFans alternative called Liddy Like a T. Yeah. And uh, yeah. basically what I would be interested in is offering you Not an exclusive attention. deal. All right where you sign to our site, all right? And I will pay you a upfront guarantee much more than OnlyFans. And I was wondering if you'd be interested. First of all, I sound like a goddamn 12 year old. Like, all right, well, running this company, like, bye. Let me ask you a question. Uh, have, you ever of, have you ever heard of fishbowl play? <laughs> what? Basically, it's an alternative foot fetish where you stick your foot in a fishbowl and start wiggling your toes. You see, we have a lot of users that are very uh, interested in that. And I'm not going to lie. 
sign me up sign me up i don't know what what it was but once he said the feet i was already in fishbowl fetish i need it i'm buying the fishbowl tonight i need to see that happen bro i don't know what it is something about a magnified foot in my face just makes me just get off a little bit you know i need to shut the fuck up that are very uh, interested in that and i was wondering if you know part of you coming to the site would be you kind of indulging in some of those, you know, more weird actions <laughs> for the viewer base, if you know what I'm that saying. That is just a yeah. no, thank you. Well, what about a million dollars upfront guarantee? Oh, Jeff, why are you still speaking to me? Oh, shit. Why are you still talking what? to me? Oh. Well, I... Dog face, I'm gonna fucking scream. Who the fuck is this guy? What? Oh. What are you talking about? No, 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 oh, I wasn't even no. talking. What are you hey, talking no, about? No, hey, shut the hell up. The fuck? Who the fuck is the what was that? Was that spit? Oh, excuse me, I just want to let you know a giant oh, spit, a giant spit particle uh, just flew from your mouth and um, landed on your camera. So, <laughs> excuse me, Camilla. Who are you, dog? I told you already. I'm Jeff Bridges. I'm a talent scout for LadyLikeAtitty.com. <laughs> LadyLikeAtitty.com. Why he say it like that, bro? <laughs> LadyLikeAtitty.com. LadyLikeAtitty.com. <laughs> You ready? I'm Jeff Bridges. I'm a talent scout for LadyLikeAtitty.com. <laughs> Let me tell you something. Yeah, okay, yeah. You're either a subscriber of my OnlyFans trying to just talk to me, which is really fucking weird, or you're just a literal fat just trying to troll All people. All right, well, so get the fuck out of here. I don't like egos. You know what I'm saying? I don't like OnlyFans bitches' egos. You're just a subscriber. The whole world don't revolve around you. I mean, yeah, you in this video, da da da, but the whole world don't revolve around you. You know what I'm saying? Not everybody subscribes to your OnlyFans. What's the link to her OnlyFans, bro? I'm about to see if it's really like that, bro. You're just a literal fat just trying to troll All people. All right, well, so get the fuck out of here. well, do you think that people that subscribe to your OnlyFans are weird? I think anyone who's an OnlyFans subscriber is a little weird. So you think? That I mean, some of them are really so, so so, so let me get, oh, wait a second, wait a second, wait a second, wait a second, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me, Jeff Bridges is talking, so when Jeff Bridges talks, you stop talking. That's how I'm gonna feel about y'all. Okay. So, what, what is this? Probably a fucking 50 year old fat fuck who lives in his mom's basement for all I fucking know. I fight with She has no respect for men. Well, I am at work Men right are now. a means to an end to her. Lady like a titty dot com. <laughs> like I thought it was quite obvious. I'm here to recruit you to lady like a titty dot com. Like I, 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 I made that very obvious from the second I joined. You know what? You know what? I'm starting to get annoyed. I'm starting to get annoyed because every five seconds you're starting to get annoyed. You're constantly fucking yelling and screaming like a fucking banshee. You're like, you sound like a fucking jackal from Halo 3. So listen, listen. I need you to, I need you to take it from here down here. Okay. I need you to calm down right now because you're very annoying. Okay. You're very annoying, and I want to understand something quick. So you're basically telling me that the people that support you, the people that put a roof over your head, that buy the food you eat for dinner tonight, you think that they're all weirdos? All your supporters, you just think that they're weirdos and losers, correct? Stand on business. Some of them, but like, they got me this fire-ass Rolex and it's pink, because they know that like, you know, it's pink. It's can pink. I hey, what? can I ask you a genuine question? This shit looks silver. Jeff Bridges is very curious right now. Do you think that you're better than me because you have that Rolex? Like, I'm just wondering. Absolutely, you fat. Sometimes y'all make the wrong people famous, bro. She think a watch makes her better than Jeff Bridges, bro. You know what I'm saying? She thinks a watch, a materialistic watch, makes her better than someone else. And that's why I call her an E-thought. Now, <laughs> So you think that if somebody doesn't have a Rolex, it automatically makes them worse than you? Is that is that how your brain works? You have, you have nothing. To, you have nothing to offer. Not, it's not only the Rolex. It's he, not only the Rolex. He offered you a million. Oh, how about, have you, excuse me. I bet you have a goddamn Nissan Altima. You're probably 35. You're what's in the range of like. What's wrong awkward. with the Nissan? Excuse me. What's wrong with the Nissan Altima? You're just a brokey, like you're a brokey. Every single one of y'all that drive a Nissan Altima, you're automatically broke. She said it here first, you know what I'm saying? That's what she said. She said, if you drive a Nissan Altima or actually any Nissan, you a broke bitch. Broke nigga, broke bitch. Hey, she said it here, you know, not me, she said it. Do you hate everybody who's not rich? Do you hate, like, of course, like, duh. Like, we're not gonna be friends with people. What? She got it. She got to be trolling. This, this has to be. One rich person I don't know. That is not friends with all rich people. Bro, you sell your no, ass for money. No, you're, an, no. you're an internet stripper. No. You're an I'm internet stripper. You sell your ass for money. If this not money, real, you have the audacity yes, to try to shit talk. I don't even know what to say. You, you have this the is bad. To Some people can't tell if this is real or not. Me, I can't tell. She is a horrible human being if this is if this is real and authentic. Like, damn, that's how you feel? That's how people feel out here in these world? You know what I'm saying? That shit crazy. First of all, Jeff and Bridges, show your goddamn face, you pussy. I am. It's in Second my profile picture, you dumb 
bitch. How about you fucking open your eyes and look? <laughs> Stop speaking to me unless your annual income is over a million dollars. So let me ask you a question. Let me ask you a question. Do your parents love you? Do your parents love you? I'm just curious. I don't, I don't give a f I don't know. Probably. And why would you ask your grandfather if he wants Plus to that. if who, he wants to be alone in a room with you? Who does that? Are you good? Are you good? You ask your. I have a Rolex. I have a nice house. I have a nice car. I'm good. Okay, but you have a Rolex, but do you have any respect for yourself? Is she happy? That's my question. Do you have any respect well, for yourself? Because I have a Rolex, I have no respect for myself. Bitch, you, you ask your granddad and your brother some weird ass questions. Do you respect yourself or not? I think you lost respect for yourself once you asked your granddad what he would do in a room with you. Where the fuck you asked? And you didn't, you asked your brother about bubblegum pink. What the fuck is wrong with you, bro? Well, because I have a Rolex, I have no respect for myself. You no, sound dumb. No, because because you sell yourself out to the point where let's see, you're using your family members and putting them in weird situations for mm -hmm. clout. That's weird as fuck. Do you not? Nobody in that? my goddamn family. No one in my family has a fucking problem with it except you weird lame motherfuckers that love to have shit to talk about. Like listen, half of the views you so got from me, the one down here that is getting real motherfucking quiet. Shut the fuck up, Jeff. The one down here that's getting real motherfucking quiet the whole time. Shut your so she might this might be real chat this might be real her ego can't be that high she can't have a huge ego from doing only fans and being in mr beast video and all the like niggas love her or whatever the fuck they got going on it can't be that much of an ego like you are in a blessed position to be getting whatever money you're getting from only fans from these niggas that you calling weirdos you're not appreciating what you got that's crazy because in in any second that shit can be gone bro tighten the fuck up <laughs> <laughs> so, Grandpa, hypothetically, if we were to go into a dark room together, would you want um, <laughs> sniff my butt crack? I don't know about that one, sweetie. Grandpa, please! Just a left up to my ugly cell. No nostril for like irrigation canals. Your neck is longer than a puppet turn. And you look like you eat soup with a shovel. Just your neck is longer than a punt return. Oh my fucking god. Wow. Irrigation canals. Your neck is longer than a puppet turn. And you look like you eat soup with a shovel. Just a left up to you struggle to process anything. <laughs> what the fuck is that? What the fuck did he come from? Is that her boyfriend? Everybody unsubscribe from OnlyFans. Everybody unsubscribe for her OnlyFans, bro. She been scamming us for years. <laughs> I don't even know this girl. <laughs> nah, if you if you subscribe, that's her boyfriend. Unsubscribe, bro. She's getting fucked by somebody else right now. <laughs> <laughs> you would literally fucking jump in front of a car to touch a girl like this. Like you look up, are you really an off brand sneaker, bro? Like that ain't sneaker, that's sneaky. <laughs> <laughs> The thing is, your only defense and comeback is where Rich is and she's hot as What about you, my nigga? Like, what do you do? Are you only known as her, like, boyfriend? Nigga, she leave, you have nothing in life, bro. You're a loser. Like, you are a loser for the rest of your life if she's gone. Your only accolade in life is that you the OnlyFans, bitch. You have nothing to show for yourself, nigga. Am I mean, bro? Am I mean? Hold on, my fault, bro. I'm sorry. You just, you just fucking ugly. <laughs> What? What? 
ashamed of your entire life, but you are ashamed of your girlfriend. Before you go into public, you put a bucket on your head and call it an IOL VPN. Well, now they know it's me. What are you saying, bro? Are you really that desperate for that OnlyFans money because you broke his head? Your mom just auctioned off your last pair of socks on eBay. Well, I'm the host by last ride. It's okay, honey. Use these oven mitts as socks. Your mom got you using oven mitts as socks. Just so broke it so and nobody cares. You can't even afford a toilet. You just shit in a bucket and spray for breeze on it. Hey, that works. It's also a little ugly. Oh. My lawyer's gonna contact you. What the hell is she talking about, bro? What what the fuck was she even talking about?